As an agency, it's normally our job to sell a product. It's not often we get to have an idea that leads to the creation of a completely new product line for mass retail. But that's exactly what happened when the UK's largest craft beer brand, Brewdog, briefed us to launch their newest bar in Soho. As new arrivals to the area, Brewdog wanted to do something to celebrate Soho's world-famous reputation for diversity and inclusivity. Our solution? Yes, science! We read about a strain of hops, the female flowers of which are the flavouring ingredient in beer, that are able to alter their biological makeup. Hops that can actually change their gender. In this case, switching from male to female. And that gave us an idea. An idea that became No Label. The world's first transgender beer. A beer brewed from hops that have undergone a hermaphroditic male to female sex change. In fact, No Label was a Kolsch style beer, brewed with ale yeast and then cold conditioned to give the characteristics of a lager. So even the liquid in the bottle resists categorization, drawing parallels with individuals who identify in a similar non binary way. Every single penny of profit from the sale of No Label was donated to charities supporting the transgender community via a group called Queerest of the Queer. We ended up raising thousands of pounds, and the group even put their name on the bottle. A huge media outreach campaign delivered a reach of over 1.1 billion in just five days. It gave us permission to talk about Brewdog's passion for craft and its belief that great tasting beer should be for everyone regardless of age, colour, creed or gender. And it just goes to show, you don't need a glossy ad or a massive media budget to start a conversation. You just need to put the right product in the right people's hands.